Hello, I'm Tony from Bonner's Music. We've got two very large keyboard shops. One is based in Eastbourne on the south coast of Sussex, and the other one is in Rygate in Surrey, just off of Junction 8 of the M25 motorway. So the purpose of this video is to uh, try and explain uh, the differences between a function that was on the Tyros 5 and actually previous Tyros models, which was called the Music Finder. And this was a feature that was very popular with UK keyboard players. Um, but now that Yamaha have uh, moved forwards to the new Genos uh, keyboard. Um, Music Finder doesn't exist on there. However, there is a new feature called Playlist, which um, almost sort of takes Music Finder one step further. So what I want to do is try and explain to you the differences between um, the Music Finder on the Tyros series and the Playlist function on the Genos, and hopefully um, explain to you how you can work with the new Playlist function, and it should actually uh, enhance your playing and give you more options than were ever found in the Music Finder. So here we go. So I thought it would be good to start off just by explaining what the Music Finder function is and how it worked. Um, so Music Finder, basically gave you a huge list of song titles. Um, there were actually over 2,000 of them in the uh, Tyros 5. Um, and you could call up one of these songs and it would select an appropriate style and an appropriate sound and the right tempo to play that particular tune. So let's just have an example of that. So we'll press the Music Finder button on the Tyros 5. We can scroll through and we're gonna choose, let's choose American Patrol, press Enter. Now, if I come back out of that screen, we go back to our home screen, you'll see it selected the big band jazz rhythm. It selected some appropriate voices to go with that rhythm. Um, it's given us the right tempo um, and it's ready to play. However, there is a limitation with Music Finder in that it will only ever give you four different sounds to play a particular song. And the reason for that is that Music Finder was based around using the one touch settings. Now, the one touch settings are these four buttons on the right here and their factory preset. And whenever you call up a style, it also calls up four sounds that are appropriate for that style of music. Now, Music Finder, all it did really was to select um, a rhythm that's the right kind of rhythm for the song you've selected from the database. And then it would just automatically select one of the, uh, the four preset um, one-touch settings. So this actually means you are actually quite limited because if you've got a list of 2,000 songs, lots of them are probably going to use the same rhythms, uh, but for different tunes. But it also means those different tunes are actually using the same right-hand voices as well. So although you've got 2,000 songs in your list, um, some of them could be a bit repetitive in the settings that they call up. So this is where Genos has actually improved this situation. So uh, Yamaha have um, done away with Music Finder, it doesn't exist on Genos, but it's been replaced with Playlist. And Playlist works in a different way in that it still gives you a list of song titles, which is great, but those songs actually call up a bank of registrations. Now, on the Genos, you actually have the option to have up to 10 registrations in a bank. So each song title you call up using the playlist can actually fill up actually 10 of your registration memory. So you could have 10 different voice combinations and style combinations for one song. So uh, pl a playlist is, is a lot more flexible um, than the Music Finder ever was on Tyros 5. Okay, so let's start off by exploring the example playlist that comes already stored inside the Genos when you get it brand new from the factory. So we press the playlist button and that should bring up uh, the example playlist. Now, if yours isn't showing the example playlist, I just want you to touch the little box at the top of the screen there. Make sure you've got preset chosen and then press example. Then press playlist again and it should bring up this uh, this list of songs of which there are 12 different song titles in there. So to select a song, you can go down, let's maybe choose Amazing Grace, then we press the little load button on the bottom right of the screen. Now, if you see what's happened here, this has actually brought up the score page um, because 
um, Amazing Grace has been programmed to actually bring up the music which is stored inside, or the sheet music which is stored inside Genos, as well as give you the appropriate um, backing to play the song. Now, this is just the example playlist that Yamaha give you with a keyboard. However, there's a much more useful and comprehensive playlist available that you can download from the Yamaha website. So really, that's what I want you to do now. So um, if you look at the link in the description to this video, you will find the link to Yamaha's Genos support page where you can actually download um, a, a new example playlist for Genos. Um, and this gives you a lot more song titles and a lot of different categories. So please go to that uh, website link below download the, uh, the file, and then um, you need to extract it onto a USB stick from your computer. So you need to get the file, open it on the computer, and your computer will ask you to extract the file, which means basically um, copy the file and all the folders and everything that contained in it onto a USB stick. So I'm gonna let you do that now, and then come back to this movie, and then we can move forwards, and I can show you how Playlist can work for you at home. Okay, so I've got my USB stick with my extracted playlist on it. So I'm gonna pop that into my Genos here. And then we're gonna press the playlist button. Now, I've still got the example playlist on the screen. So if I touch up the top where it says example in that little box, I now have the choice of either the preset playlist or a user playlist. It's got a little picture of a USB stick there, so let's just tap on that. And I need to then press USB on the left-hand side here. And now you will see on the screen the playlist for Genos, which is actually the folder we downloaded from the Yamaha support website. So let's open that up. And what Yamaha have done, have categorized all of the different songs into their various music styles and put each one into a folder. So let's choose jazz. And then we select the Genos playlist for jazz. There we go and press playlist. Now we've selected the Genos jazz playlist and all of the songs that are here, um, are of which there are 35 of them, are all sort of jazz and blues orientated. So we could just go down and choose, so for instance, American Patrol, press load. Now, what you will notice is that nine of your registration memory lights have lit up. And what that means is there are actually nine different voices and style combinations for you to play American Patrol. Now just think how much more powerful that is than the old Tyros 5, where you only had four preset sounds to use for each song. You've now got nine different voice and style combinations to use for American Patrol. If we choose a different um, style, or sorry, a different song, let's choose Come Fly With Me, press load. That one's loaded up six different voice combinations for playing that song Come Fly With Me. So that's the jazz playlist. What we can do is tap the playlist button again at the top. Now, we're still showing the jazz playlist on the screen, so we need to press the up arrow and from there, we can select a different style category of song. So let's choose ballroom, choose the ballroom playlist and then press playlist. And now you have the ballroom playlist on the screen. So let's choose the anniversary waltz and press load. And there we go. That has also loaded six registrations ready for you to play the anniversary waltz. So as you can see, there are lots and lots of song titles available for you to play, but each one now gives you a lot more combinations of sound to play. So it's a lot more powerful. Um, a few more button presses to get to the, to the list of songs. However, it's worth it because you get a lot more variation in the song titles. Now, it is also possible to import all of the Music Finder files from the Tyros series. So I'm gonna produce another video which is going to show you how to do that. So I hope that this video has been useful, showing you how to access the new song titles in Genos. Um, if you have any questions, then uh, please get in touch with us. Um, and if you buy your keyboard from Bonner's Music, we're always here to give you expert support on your new keyboard, whether it's a Tyros or a Genos. Anyway, thanks very much for watching. Please do look at my other video, which will show you how to import your Music Finder file from your Tyros keyboard into your new Genos. See you soon.